All right, guys, we about to do a haul, a so random, random, random haul. I just got off work, so let me powder my face a little bit. I don't know. This is my Sony ZV-E10, and the face filter thing is not skin soft or whatever. It's not even on, but I don't, it's not making me look natural. I'm supposed to look good. This is my Shop Miss A. Y'all see? Hold on. I'm going to have to tweak this a little bit because they don't like the look blurry. Okay, guys. So, I hope the audio is good because I call myself with a new microphone and hopefully everything is good. It's, I'm not peeking. Okay. So, first up, it's random. It's the haul going to be all over the place, right? So, we got Sam's Beauty. Yeah, I know at least once a month I have to get me some items from Sam's Beauty, right? So, bam. <laughs> Wig caps. They were like 69 cents and then they were buy one, get one free. So, I got the brown shade. Did y'all see? I don't like that glare. Brown shade, the dark brown shade, and should be a light one in here somewhere. I don't know. And the black. So light brown, dark brown, black. And I got five of each of them. Look at me. I don't know why it's like that. I don't like that. Better. Maybe the lens is just dirty. <laughs> okay, so got some of those. And I think I got a leave-in conditioner because I needed like a leave-in conditioner for like the longest time. And y'all, I burned my hand on the oven about three days ago. So I'm going to have to swatch on my left hand. I read somewhere that rosemary was really good for uh, making your hair healthy and giving it some luster and shine. So I got this rosemary and mint leave-in conditioning spray by Dye Feel, Different Feel, Different Feel. Infused with biotin, helps promote growth, manageability, and shine. Helps repair split ends and moisturizes dry, flaky scalp. I am now on my hair, healthy hair journey. So we'll do a separate video on that. But this is just a leave-in conditioning spray. I don't know how much it was. It was something. I got a wig, of course. It's the Outre 5x5 Closure Wig. And Body Wave 16 inch in the color number two. And this is how the box looks. Don't ask me the price, y'all. No idea. Just know that it probably was on sale. So this is how this is how the back looks. So we'll be trying that. I got another air tied human hair blend, 100 percent fully hand tied wig. And this is in the color. FB HBF Honey, and this is a 12 inch. This is a bob. Oh, there it looks like that. So that's how it looks. Let me see the color. No stock card on there. I can show you how the stock card. It's a 12 inch bob, but that's the stock card. I wanted a bob, and plus, y'all know I love that type of color anyway. So, yeah, we're going to try that eventually. Soon. <laughs> eventually, soon, whenever I take these braids out, which will probably be ne next month, because so far I had them in a month, and I'm trying to stretch it to at least get two months worth of wear out of it. 
because paid all this money. It's got to last at least two months, but they're going out, as you can see already. Something that I have been loving, surprisingly, comes from Bath & Body Works. I have never really been a fan of like Bath & Body Works, like their body lotions and stuff. I just feel like they're not long-lasting and not moisturizing enough for me. But I did pick up, I don't know, I guess this is from their spa collection or whatever. It's the Breathe Deep Eucalyptus and Lavender. I did a community post <clears throat> telling you guys about it. And it's a whipped body butter. Looks like this. And this is how much I have used. It smells good. It's so moisturizing on my skin. And the scent is the lavender and vanilla or eucalyptus and lavender. And it's so relaxing and spa-like. I put I have been putting on this on every night after I take my shower and whatever. Mixed with the lavender and vanilla body oil. It's a body and massage oil with shea butter and argan oil in it loving this love 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 this the combo with the body butter and the oil amazing and i also have it in eucalyptus experiment that's just something about being relaxed when i get off work after a long day of work and just uh taking a long shower moisturizing my body will knock me out put me right to sleep with no problem so these are the two and it was just so random. I went on Bath and Body Works and I'm like, oh, they got something new. I need to check them out. Let me put this right here because I got to put it back in the bathroom. And I'm so glad I did. Now I'm interested in trying. I think they've had probably like three or four more different body butters that I want to try. So put this stuff back in the box. So random, right, y'all? So I can take the hairspray. That in, Cause that can go back in the bathroom too. So next up is real random. Trust me. Trust me when I tell y'all. So I said that I wanted to be like healthy, healthy, get my hair back healthy or whatever. Since I cut my locks. Oh no. Oh, that's probably right. So I went on J.C. Penney's website just so randomly, right? And. They had a sale in their spa area. Oh, wow, I put this stuff in this wet bag. And it was 50% off. Buy one, get one 50% off or 40% off. And then with a coupon and all that. So I got it. Right? And this, I remember this stuff like when I was growing up. Like you had to be have a hair license to get it. But I know more you don't. So the first one is Mazzani True Texture Curls, Coils, and Waves Sleek Holding Gel. And it's infused with coconut oil, olive oil, marula oil, and shea moist moss extract. So it looks like this. And I tried a little bit on my edges. And it's like real, you can see it hanging jelly-like. It's not stiff. It's more jelly-like. I didn't smell it though. Mm, yeah, it has a smell like a... Like a vanilla almost. So it's really jelly like. I figured that would be good for me if I wanted to do like a twist out or something. That would be good. Then I got some more Mazzani. My original order uh, came and they were missing three pieces. I'm like, hey, I'm missing three products. And it came. I had to call them. They had to refund, ship it back out. And it came like two days later. So it's the Mazzani hairdress coconut Souffle. Is that souffle? Hmm. Lightweight moisturizing hairdress. Uh, mineral oil free. Petroleum free. And it looks like this. I didn't open this yet. Yeah, it smells, it smells the same as the thing. It's just white. But my, I'm the type of hair. I don't know what type of texture you would call it. What I have. But my hair loves oil and cream and water for moisturizer. Like, it loves it. Like, it just thrives off. Especially give me some regular, like, hair grease. My hair loves it. 
Next, I used this like two days ago and my hair has been moisturized, my scalp, because it was getting kind of dry. So that's what really made me like try to dig deep and find stuff that was going to work for my hair. But I used to use this when I had a perm. And it's the Design Essentials Herbal Complex for Hair and Scalp Treatment. Treat relaxed or natural hair. Free of silicones. And this is how it looks. I know y'all seen this. Oh, I love the way it smells too. It smells like hair grease. If you like from the 80s and you know what hair grease smells like, I don't think these new age teenagers or young people know what hair grease smells like. But yeah, my scalp loves this stuff. Loves this stuff. Next up is the... Oh, I, got, I don't know why I put it in a wet bag. Ooh, I don't even know how to spell it. Ooh, ooh, I died. Moisture Lock Leave-In Conditioner. The leave-in with no unwanted leave behind. And I love leave-in conditioners also because I might wash my hair like twice, maybe two, three times a month. But I always put in a leave-in conditioner. And this is my first time trying this product right here. Uh, breathable moisture found foundation that encourages curls to form and leave hair soft and silky with moisturizing prickly pear cactus extract. A lot of the stuff that I have been picking up has pear extract in it. Anti-exodont, anti-exodont, am I saying the word? Anti-exodont, green tea, and arnica extract. <laughs> Our formula deeply hydrates curls with no greasy residue left behind. I haven't tried it yet, but we shall try it soon. Next up, I have some Mazzani Scalp Care Reviving and Refreshing Calming Scalp Lotion for all type textures uh, with menthol, aloe, aloe, avocado oil, and eucalyptus oil. As you can see, I got a thing for eucalyptus. Looks like this. Maybe let me turn on the light. Hold on, y'all. All right, guys, I figured it out. My ISO, ISO thing was too high for the light I got in here. But anyway, it's a Mazzani Scalp Care Reviving and Refreshing Scalp Lotion. Oh, yeah, that's much better. I can't take that glare no more. But yeah, try that. Next up is the Design Essential Scalp and Hair Care Vitamin E Drops with Vitamin A, Beta, Coratine, Omega-3, and Omega-6. Dermatologist tested. As you can see, I've been using some of this already. So, yeah. Uh, I wish the bottle was better. I can say, let's see. There's no, it just, if it turns over, it's going to, all you're going to be everywhere. So, yeah. Got to be careful with that. And then last from JCPenney is the Mazzani 25 Miracle Nourishing Oil for all hair types. A nourishing hair treatment with sunflower, jojoba, olive, and coconut oils. So yeah, I got a pretty, I got all of these for like 60 something dollars. So that was like a really good deal. I'm going to be into hair care. So be prepared for that on the channel because we're really going to be doing hair care. Now I got to find something. I don't want to put that oil just anywhere because I'm clumsy like that. It'll be done. I'm going to stick it on the shelf right there. My shelf is like it's on its last day. Like it's going to in any moment. So I got to be careful. So yeah, everything else is good. All right, let me grab the Ulta bag. Yeah. Okay, so now Ulta, I know I said I went order no, nothing during their 21 days of beauty, but you can't listen to me, okay? First up, this wasn't on the 21 days of beauty, but I had my eye on it for so long. It's the new LA Girl Glow in the Eyeshadow palette. And the quads are really, really big. No color that I probably don't already have in my collection, but I love drugstore. LA Girl, L'Oreal, Revlon, Maybelline. I love drugstore essence, which brings me, I'm glad I said it because I picked this up from Target a couple of weeks ago and I 
if you've been watching my videos, then you see me use it, and I'm gonna go pick up another one. It's the Essence Eyeliner 24 Hour Long Lasting Extra Long Lasting Eye Marker, and it's in black. I don't know you, if you can see it on my eyes. I have it on my eyes from today. But it's so easy to apply. It's pigmented. It doesn't crack. And it's a matte shade. So if you're in the market for a new eyeliner, I don't think it's one. It's not the burn up band. So that's it. So yeah. Okay. Random. You know, once I get into hair care, I be into hair care. So this was, how much was $39? And this is my very first Baby Bliss product. So it's the Baby Bliss Pro Nano 1 and 1 fourth Extended Barrel Curling Iron. I got it for $39. Yeah. It was either between this one or they had a Hot Tools one. But it was kind of different looking. But all the reviews was like, it didn't live up to the hype. I just decided to go with Baby Bliss since that's kind of popular. I'm all over the place. Uh huh. Next, wasn't on the sale, but I got it. Um, Ulta Beauty Healthy Hydration Cleansing Balm Replenishing Sweet Almond Oil Shea Butter. I y'all know I've been into cleansing balms to clean my. Uh, makeup off my face so this is the only thing I use I don't use a makeup remover or makeup remover wipes so I only use cleansing balm to remove my makeup and everything and I have had no issues with breakouts or any of that I find that they I usually use that usually use I usually use <laughs> the elf one but I was like I might as well try also because you know also be having some good you know under their collection some good stuff so I decided to give that a try I also am trying the long wear eye gel Bobbi Brown and I think I got one lip gloss from Bobbi Brown that's it and this is in the shade espresso ink number seven I'm gonna focus on Get in there at crazy. So let's see. I think it's a brown. Yeah. I was, you know, I'm always trying to find something that I can do my eyebrows with. Not necessarily use it as an eyeliner, even though this says it's an eyeliner. But I was like, hey, I might can do my brows with that. It Cosmetics Darks Bye Bye Dark Spot Concealer. And I got it in the shades. Nose, come on! Why can't y'all? Why can't y'all put the shades where it's readily available? Rich Cool Fifty and Tan Neutral Forty Two. So these are the two shades. So let's see, let's see. Rich Fifty. I got a foundation. Oh, this is my foundation shade, baby. I knew it was gonna be. I knew it. I can. That's crazy. That y'all see? Y'all can't even see it. It's right next to the. To the black shade, y'all can't even see it. I I have no problem matching my um foundation like concealer shades. When it comes to foundation, I had the worst time. But with concealers, like I can get my shade like spot on. And look at that highlight, like spot on. So we're gonna try this because it cosmetics. Uh, it doesn't even say. I don't even tell y'all what it was. Bye bye dark spot concealer serum, buildable medium coverage. We'll talk about the specs when I review it, but that's what I got. So the highlight shade and then my foundation shade. Usually pick up two concealers when I do pick up concealers. Ow. My hand hurting because it's peeling. Y'all know I couldn't leave without getting a... Why well, I keep pointing at y'all? <laughs> without getting a perfume. It's the Lancome Adol Nectar Perfume. And so, right, I saw it on sale, had it in my cart, me and mom went to Dillard's. I'm like, because I never smelled this one. So I'm like, mom, let me smell it while I'm in Dillard's to know if I need to order it. And the minute I sprayed it in Dillard's, when me and mom got to the car, I ordered it. I'm like, oh, yeah. And I think this one was, what size is this? This is the 1.7. So I think it was like either 40 something dollars on it. So, yeah. Y'all know I love La Vista Belle. That's my number one perfume ever hands down 
I need to get another one of those because I'm almost out. The bottle is so sleek and so different. I love Lime Calm. Look, y'all. Oh, man. You got to be careful, too, because it's so potent it that you only need a little bit. So you don't have to, like, spray crazy like me. So I can go crazy. Mm -hmm. It smells. I should tell y'all the notes, but if it's not on the box, then... We're going to have to talk about it later because y'all know it's always in French, you know. I'm, I'm not French yet. Yeah, the note's going to be somewhere else. But it's nectar. That's what I do know, okay. I do know that, okay. So, yeah. Oh, it smells good. I'm so glad that Alta did have a perfume on the 21 Days of Beauty because that's what they needed. And that's what, you know, I had my eyes set on. So, yeah, the nectar one. Try to let me know if y'all shop the 20, 21 Days of Beauty sale. Next, I don't even know why I got this from Ulta. It's the Oplex Shampoo and Conditioner number five. I never used it, but they gave it to me for whatever reason. I don't know why. All right. Moving right along. I said I was going to get it. And it's the Elf Putty Color Corrector in the shade Deep. I have it in dark. So I wanted to try deep because I felt like deep would be, you know, just a little bit more peachy. Which my dark skin needs a little bit more peachy orangeness to like color correct. So yeah, I picked that up. That went on the sale. Don't worry about it. And of course, we got some About Face. First thing, I picked up a brush from About Face. I didn't know it was going to be this little. But good thing this thing was only like uh, $3. It's called Good Stroke Color Loading Multi Brush. Y'all see that brush? I saw that thing. I said, there ain't no way they sent me this brush and this little tiny brush. I'm going to be done lose this thing the minute I sit it down. But no, this would, I figured it would be good to do my concealer underneath my eyes or any like detail type thing but it was three dollars and plus I like about face anyway so I did get an about face matte eye paint these items about face was on the 21 days of beauty and this is in the shade weightless and of course it's a brown I never shop anywhere without getting me a brown shade of something it has to be so and I always can use this for eyeshadow, lip liner, whatever I want to use it for. Did y'all see that? Yes. Just what I needed. What is this? Brow artist. So About Face had brow products. I didn't know that. So it's like a brow marker. And this is in the shade Black Brown. I really hope y'all can see me because I can't see y'all. I don't have no monitor. My computer acting stupid. It's trying to crash on me because it don't want me to be great. And this is kind of like that uh, physician's formula one I be using. Come with a brush. Mm. That's good. Oh, it's not a marker. It's like the, what do you call that one? The benefits. It's kind of like the benefits one. So let's see. Let's put it down here. Oh, creamy, black brown. Okay, about about face is the new brand for you to check out and be on the lookout for. So I got black brown and I got a chocolate brown. So let's see, chocolate brown is the new thing for you to look for because they've been hitting lately. Okay, let's do chocolate brown. Oh, I just broke it. No, no, stop being so rough. You ain't got no money to waste like that, girl. This is a little lighter. Well, I will do this for the front of my brows. So it don't be so dark. But yeah, y'all see the difference. That is chocolate, though. Chocolate and black brown. Chocolate is cute. And I got two of the NYX concealers. That I told y'all I was going to go back and get because I had already had deep walnut and I think cinnamon. And so I went and I got 
golden and sienna golden and sienna i think i got i don't know i got golden to highlight with i don't really know why oh yeah i got golden to highlight with golden right here and sienna I think I got Sienna because I thought that was my foundation shade, but I don't know. And then Sienna right there. Alta. I think I got some more. Yeah, we're not done. I got a LA Girl Pro Perfect All Control Multitasking Matte Setting Spray. Wanted to give this a try. This is new along with the eyeshadow collection. This is something new from them. So I wanted to get, seems like you got to shake it up. Got some white powder at the bottom. I guess that's the mattifying um, stuff. What else I got? I got an About Face Longwear Gel Eyeliner. Which I say it's a brown, but I could use it for a lip liner. Y'all know I use eyeliners for lip liners, lip liners for eyeliners. They don't matter to me. If it's pigmented, I use it. Okay. This is in the shade Escritin. Ecrisitin. Y'all, if you can see the name, then y'all can see what it is. Can y'all see? I'm going to put it right there in the middle. It's focusing. No. <laughs> it's probably like, girl, get out of here, Nana. We don't have time for you today. Hold on, let me see. Maybe if I put it against something white. Let me see. No. I'll put it on the screen first. Oh, is that throw the thing? Throw the thing back in the box. We need to took it out the box. Okay, let's see. Hot face. Yeah, it's, it's skinny. It has this, ooh, that's pretty. Oh, yes, baby. We can use that for a lip liner at the bottom. Y'all probably say you got a handful of brown shades on it. Do you honestly think that they look different? Yes, they look different. And I got a LA Girl Brow Ink Detailer Pen in Dark. Brown. I've been on my brow kick. I've been on just any kind of kick. And it looks like that. So let's see. I feel it comes with a spoolie. And oh, it's very detailed. Yeah, it's, it's small. I mean, it's tiny. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's going to go good for the front. Put the top on it real tight. Right there. Some lashes from Amazon. These are not the ones I'm used to ordering, and I'm so mad. I keep going to my Amazon history and trying to get the ones that I'm used to, and none of them are it. A room spray from, we'll talk about the candles, because I brought some candles too, from Goose Creek, because Bath and Body Works candles have not been doing what they need to do. They've been burning really fast. I've been having like this much wax left and the wick is gone and i'm i cut my wick every time i burn it so yeah but this is a lemon butter cake by goose creek it's a room spray i've been burning their candle for the last week and oh that smells so good i love lemon y'all know i love lemon mm -hmm. that's it and so random but the last thing for now are two crop tops that I got from Target from the wild. Ooh, that smells good. Ooh, that smell like lemon bacon cake, pound cake in the oven. I'm hungry. Okay. Crop top, wild fable, size large from Target. They were like $3. I got it a brown. Of course, everything I get, I got to get a brown. Like, why, girl? Why? And a peach shade. A little crop top. 
nice pair of jeans or some shorts for the summertime because it's too hot to even care. And my microphone, right quick. Where is it? Kit. Oh, I got the box. I don't know where the other box is. Oh, here it is. I got the Comica from Amazon. It was $129 and they were having a flash sale. So I got it for like $89. So hopefully this audio is going to be better than the built-in audio in there. But it comes with one receiver and two mics. I don't know how it works, but this is how the box looks. So this is the other one, of course, I'm not using. So yeah. And oh, it's okay, testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing. Because I already talk low. I already talk low, and it's like I need something that's going to pick my audio up. So, I, and I just clip it on there. But yeah. Yeah. So, this is my random haul. Guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Drop down and let me know if you ordered from Alta the 21. Why did I put it back in the box? The 21 Days of Beauty. I think it's like a couple Oh, there. I was looking for the instructions for this stupid thing. And it's in the box in the Ziploc bag. I was just trying to figure it out myself. That's what I get for not looking. I'm going to sit it to the side when I wake up from my nap at 3 o'clock in the morning. And I'll play with it some more. But, yeah, y'all trying to let me know what items that you have purchased or whatever. Y'all know I'm always interested in, you know, seeing new items from you guys. And that's it. Because I just had to get this stuff out of the boxes and away. But I got some more hauls coming because I got some more stuff coming. Of course, on Shop Miss A because they got some new items. So, yeah. So, yeah, guys. I'm out of here. Peace out.